first I'm going with a shimmering cream shadow to act as a base for the rest of the look. All the eyeshadows that I use in this tutorial are from my good old trusty Naked palette and this is the Naked One palette. So the first colour I'm going with is Half Baked which is a very strong shimmery gold colour and I'm applying that to the outer half of my lid. Now I'm going in with Sin which is a shimmery champagne colour and I'm just going to apply that to the other half of the eye, so towards the inner tear duct. Now with the colour Naked, I'm just going to use this to blend out the shimmery colours so it's not so much a glitter ball on my eyes, but this will just soften the look and make it look more transitioned towards the eyebrow. Now I'm just using Virgin as a highlight and you only need a really small amount of this eyeshadow, it goes a bit crazy if you use too much. Now with a white pencil I'm just going to line the inner rim of my eyes just to brighten up the look to make it look all innocent and nice. And now with a pencil liner I'm just going to very lightly smudge along my upper lash line. And this is just going to hide the line of the false lashes that I'm about to apply. So it doesn't need to be perfect. And these are the lashes that I'm applying. They are super, super long and super dramatic, but you can go with any kind that you like. Here I'm just tracing over the lash band to blend it in a little bit more with a liquid eyeliner with my good old one by one mascara I'm just going to apply a coat to my lower lashes because hey we can't forget about those guys Father Christmas, give us some money. We got no just taking a shimmery peachy blush this one is dainty by Mac and I'm just going to apply a little bit to my cheeks you don't want to get a blush that's too shimmery though otherwise you're just gonna look like a glitter ball and well unless you want to look like that <laughs> Now with my good old bow lipstick in Natural Tea Rose, I'm just going to apply this to my lips. Now you can go with a nude if you like, but I thought a nice kind of berry toned lipstick would go nicely with this look. And that's it for the nice tutorial. So as you saw, it was really freaking easy and pretty much anyone can do it. And I think it looks really great for say family parties and things like that because it's not too dramatic and it makes you look really nice and innocent. <laughs> okay, now for the naughty tutorial. I'm using the same cream shadow, so it's Glammy Goes To by Essence and if you can get your hands on this, I absolutely love it. It's so good. Just just freaking get it. <laughs> now with a matte black eyeshadow, I'm going to start at the inner corner, go all the way into my crease and all the way to the inner corner like that. So it kind of forms a semicircle. And I know it looks like complete shit and very, very messy, but don't worry, as you can see, I'm blending it out with a big fluffy brush. Now this black is just kind of a base color for the next color that I'm going to apply. So don't worry if it's messy, it doesn't have to be perfect. So this is the next colour that I was talking about. It's a nice rich cranberry maroony kind of colour. And I'm just going to go over the black that we just applied. What this does is it kind of richens the look of the eyeshadow and I don't know, layering is always good. So I think it looks best when you layer it over black. You can see again, I'm just blending it out with a fluffy brush. Now I'm going in with a shimmery gold colour and I'm just going to apply that where the rest of the black didn't go. So just kind of on the ball of your eyelid we're just going to go over that. And what this does is it creates a nice round shine to the eye and it makes it really pop. And there I go blending again. <laughs> Here very quickly I'm just dragging some of that maroon colour under my eyelashes just to connect the eyeshadow. Now with this clip unfortunately you can't see too much but I'm just using the matte black eyeshadow as a winged liner. I think it looks a lot more softer than liquid eyeliner, if that makes sense. 
Now with my pencil black eyeliner, I'm going to line my inner waterline. This step's optional, but if you want to go all out, go right ahead for it. So with a glitter eyeliner, I'm just going to trace under my lash line. And I think this just kind of glamorizes the whole look. It makes it just pop so much more. Now I'm going to go ahead and apply eyelashes, but like I said before, you apply whatever you like. Then I'm finishing up the eyes with a generous coat of mascara to my bottom eyelashes. I'm just going to go with something really simple and easy and go with bronzer. Now go really lightly with this, you don't want to go too heavy otherwise you're going to look like a big bruised face with dark eyes and dark cheeks, so go easy with it. So here's the part where you guys get to choose. So the first lipstick that I'm trying on is a nude lipstick and this is just for all of you who like more of a simple look, you don't want to be too dramatic, it just really finishes off the look really nicely. But if you've got the balls, go ahead and rock the red lipstick. I'm just going in with a pencil liner to outline my lips and to also fill them in. And to finish up, I'm just dabbing some red lipstick over my lips to add a little bit of gloss. Pretty much it for the naughty tutorial so I definitely recommend this for a formal Christmas party a dress-up Christmas party pretty much anything Christmassy so that's pretty much it for this tutorial I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in my next video